Hi there, this is Beatrice Yakubu from Simply Family Business, where we help you to build a fun, fruitful family business with your children. How do I know that? Because I've done it with my children. I am and I am on a mission. What's my mission? My mission is to help you as a parent to be able to build a business with your children so that you get to live the life that you desire and the life that you deserve. In terms of building a business, you need a model. And that is why I'm doing this series to go, go with you through these models that um, I have for you. My Simply Family Business model is a six part uh, frame. We have done S, I, and this is M. This video is for M, which is mastery. If you haven't watched those before, I employ you Go back, watch search, watch um, identify, and then you come to mastery. What is mastery? In terms of a business, when you are starting a business, you should have a mission. You know, all these businesses that you know of, that you purchase from, have a mission. The mission is the compelling thing that you are going, that is more or less your promise to your customers. What can they uh, expect from you? is your mission you need to think about that in setting your business goals you need to think about the seven f's and what are these you need to think about your firm which is your business itself very very critical because without a goal you are likely going to drift a lot in terms of focus you want to be focused even though it's going to be a fun business you also want to treat it like a business and having goals is what will make that happen next is your finance in fact what when you start a business financial freedom is always the reason why we start a business and you if you are replacing your job income yes you need to be thinking about what are the timelines that are important for you to be able to get to that point so that you can perhaps give up your job or even if you're in business so that you can scale so your finance is important family in as much as you're doing a business you do not want your family life to suffer and that is critical in fact patrice and her husband patrice washington and gerald washington was doing a program about this and then they talked about putting in a calendar uh in your calendar for family time and some people will say why do i have to put in a time for my family it can't be spontaneous because because you are building a business sometimes uh, other priorities can get pushed aside and that is why having family goals is important but then your uh, fun you need to f have fun as well because otherwise you are going to be burned out and perhaps you know lose the zeal to do this uh, important thing of uh, getting your family business going then fitness yes your health is very important as far as um as far as your goals are concerned because without your body being well you cannot run a business then your faith faith is important because without faith if you are a christian hallelujah <laughs> if you are not you still need to believe in something higher than yourself why is that important because without that there are certain times that you won't understand certain things you just have to trust that it will work out and that is why your faith is important and last but not the least is your friends because you are starting a business doesn't mean you reject your friends. In fact, but I must say there are certain friends that have to stay away while you are doing some of this. But of course, you have to bear that in mind that, you know, you keep your friends as well. So those are the family, um, I mean, the, the, the goals as far as your, um, the M side is concerned and then scale. In addition to that, you need to think about your goals. In fact, the goals are so important when it comes to business because without a goal, it is like there is no purpose. There is no reason. And sometimes, to be honest, 
when you start a business just like your work sometimes you wake up and you don't want to go to work but you still have to go to work but with business because it's your own if you don't have a goal sometimes you, you stay in bed <laughs> because you know you you think what's the point so your goals are important and with goals we have the seven f's system of getting your goals written so that it's not just about business because believe it or not you have children and if your business is just about i mean your goals is just about business you know life is going to be boring when you make the money what are you going to do with it you will need some fun so why don't you start the fun while you know you are in the process of making the money so the f the seven f system would help you to be able to design the goals that would propel you forward so that when the dark days come within your journey, you know, you are not shaking. What are the five F's? Number one is your firm. So the firm is definitely your business where you really want to take this business. Uh, number two is your family. You know, you need to still have your family time and all those things. Um, I was watching Patricia and her husband talk about uh, family goals. And then they said, uh, some people will say, why calendar in? or pencil in your calendar your meeting with your children but the and then their answer was if you don't do that especially as in business it's going to be pushed aside but your family is equally important that's why you're building the business with your children anyway so yes family is another your fitness you need to be fit to be able to do this and then taking having goals for that is important Friends, you don't have to desert your friends because you are doing business. Surely not. Faith, if you are a Christian, great. If not, you need to think, believe in a higher superpower other than yourself. Otherwise, you know, sometimes in this world, you can't tell that are superpowers, whether you agree with that or not. And you need to have that courage to be able to resi have resilience so that when the winds are not blowing in your direction, then of course you have a stay in power. Then of course your uh, fun, as a family you still need to have fun. And uh, last one, I can't remember. <laughs> so those are uh, the, the, the seven ones. Hopefully I will remember that one and we would, um, you know, I'll finish the video with that. In terms of the last one is scaling, how would you scale this business? Is that you need to think about if I'm selling a pen, how can I, what can I add to it for it to work? If I want to scale the business in the future, if I'm selling a pen, I can think about adding a book, adding a um, pen set, adding an eraser and things like that. So your business, think about how you can scale. And that would work for you in the future because if you want to scale, then you don't have to go back to the drawing board. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you on the next one.